Assalamu alaikum dear friends, I am engineer Saifullah and you are watching Saifullah engineer at side YouTube channel. Friends, today we will discuss the work inspection request procedure in the NEOM project. As you know that every project has their own procedure for the work inspection request and important attachments. But as a QC engineer, what you will attach to the WIR or work inspection request. So we will discuss in this video with the full detail. If you are a new viewer, so kindly subscribe our YouTube channel, like the video and share it with your friends. So let's start for the concrete activity. And concrete activity or first WIR is for the steel installation, second for the pump work. If there is anchor board, so we have WR for the anchor board installation and the final WR is for the concrete pouring. And after that, we also need to submit the uh, compressive strength test results for the that area of concrete. So we will start from the steel. If you have a steel inspection, so what you will attach to that WR? The most important thing is you have to attach is ITP with the checklist for the steel installation. Second is approved MIR for that steel. The third is the approved drying. The second uh, WIR for the concrete activity is palm work. So for the palm work, you have to attach ITP with checklist. Second is the most important thing for the palm work is the approved survey report. Who will submit? This will be submitted by the surveyor or site engineer and this will be approved from the consultant which should be attached to the palm work WIR and the third is should be attached we have to attach the approved drawing the third will be uh, WIR for the anchor boards if there is any anchor boards or is there a, if there is any kind of steel structure for the anchor boards ITP with checklist the second thing is approved survey report for the installation of anchor boards the third is the approved MIR for the anchor bolts and the fourth is the approved drawings. For the concrete pouring WIR you have to attach ITP with checklist and the most important thing is the MEP clearance. This area should be clear from the MEP engineers and MEP clearance should be attached to the WIR for the concrete pouring and the third is the approved drawing. In case and also you have to attach to the concrete pouring WR the pouring sheet and the delivery notes. After that, if you have uh, any kind of WR for the soil uh, excavation and big peeling or water probing, so every WR every activity has their own documents. But the most important are the general documents which should be attached: approved drawing, approved ITP, and if there is any kind of material used, so approved MIR for that material and the approved drawing for the activity. So dear friends, if you have any kind of question about the WIR or WR procedure in the NEOM project, so you can ask me in the comment section. I will try to answer your question there. Or if you have more confusion, so you can contact me through my LinkedIn, through Instagram. Links are available in the board section of the channel.